Hey everyone, welcome back to Design Gorithum, your go-to place for mastering CAD and interior design. Today we are diving into an exciting step-by-step -step tutorial on designing a stunning room interior using SketchUp on iPad. From setting up your project to adding those final stylish touches, this video is packed with everything you need. Stick till the end as I will be sharing some pro tips and tricks to make your design stand out. If you haven't already, hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so that you never miss an update. Let's jump right in. Alright, let's start by setting up our workspace and sketching out the room dimensions. You can specify the units of measurement at home page while creating a new drawing or you can do so in model info. With the rectangle tool, set the room size Double tap and group Repeat the steps for creating walls Double tap to edit group and give height to walls and floor using push pull tool. Use move plus copy. Create and assign tags. Keep visibility of one wall on and double tap to edit the group and start adding details. Use tape measure tool for precise measurements. Create multiple copies following these steps. Keep managing the geometry into groups and tags. Create window opening. window frame Mm -hmm. 
use referencing to create geometry easily. Erase extra edges. Turn on X-ray mode wherever needed. model TV unit Download assets from 3D Warehouse. Move rotate scale as per need. Thank you. 
add planters and accessories create ceiling assign proper tags This is what we have got after adding all the necessary elements. Now it's time to add textures. Use warehouse to download textures and apply them on different surfaces. You can select the face and click on texture to apply material. You can apply material on group or on individual faces. You can view your project in presentation mode. You can adjust field of view. Keep saving project at regular intervals. You can also save your scene. Turn on shadows. You can adjust time, date and other settings. You can control display styles. And as I have told you, I am going to show you a trick uh, that can make your project stand out. You can use this amazing feature called diffusion to generate rendered view of your scene. And you can tweak the settings, you can uh, uh, give your suggestions in the prompt area. Isn't it amazing? And there you have it, a complete room interior design step by step in SketchUp on iPad. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and drop a comment below with what you would like to see next. And of course, don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so that you never miss a new video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Happy designing.